So I look forward to the support of all Singaporeans for the People's Action Party. For our East Coast residents, the, we also have a plan for the East Coast. We have uh, East Coast, Singapore, we have a together at East Coast plan. We care at East Coast. So we look forward to working closely together with our residents to enable the East Coast and the whole of Singapore to emerge from this stronger. So we humbly ask for your support, for your strong endorsement, so that the team can continue to serve you and serve fellow Singaporeans in the coming years. Why was the thing thing there? Man? Ding ding. Because that, <laughs> that was the time limit. That was the time limit. Like, oh, I, I wish it could go on. But anyways, welcome to the listening room. Another episode filled with uh, joy. Yeah. So filled much with joy. joy. So we, much joy. And we have a plan for. Yeah, for, we, for are for yeah. we are the listening room. We have a plan. We have a plan for the. We are other going to talk about education. For, for the room. <laughs> podcast. Where you're listening. Speech. In this room. Right well, now well, with us well, and young women, yes. uh, yeah, yes. and the plan is good. The plan is in, good in Singapore uh, with the the time that we need to listen yeah. and the room. You yeah, know? The, the, yeah. It's, I mean, it's wow. all about the room. It's yeah, all about he, the he room. He sounds like someone that was just thrown there. You know, you know, like last minute. Like, you know, hey, you need to go there and say something. <laughs> say, say what? It's like, I, I, I'm comfortable here. And like, no, you need to go there and like say it. you have to contest the place. Huh? Uh, but, 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 not here. Uh, not not here. here. It's like, yeah, no, no, you need to go there. What time? Now. Huh? Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, uh, oh, I, uh, you DPM, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, DPM. Go lah. Uh, okay, okay. We had the, you know, East Coast. Uh, it was so hard to listen to that. And I initially thought it was a speech. I thought it was part of his like yeah. No, they, they call this a nomination speech. Yeah, so I thought yeah. there was more to it. I really thought I went the, the whole <laughs> whole week before this, right? Yeah. I thought there was a like oh, I'm being me. I haven't listened to the whole thing, and that's how he started it. But when he you know he goes on to say like, the East Coast plan cons- consists of us increasing your um, uh. Uh, like better money for infra- like infrastructure. Like yeah. Infrastructure. I'm giving yeah. you more aircon, Build better roads. Like, uh, roads. Uh, your parks. Refurbishing the parks. New MRT station. Whatever East shit. Coast, East Coast Park is going to get the a facelift. It was, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's gonna shit. yeah. The fact yeah. that it was that. Facelift. It, tummy tuck. And it, ended, and it ended with a thing thing. And you can look at this face. The sign yeah, He's like, relief. oh shit. It's no, done. Thank no, God. No, his face is like. Relief. Relief. Thank you. Uh, yeah. like, I buy for you one package. He's yeah. like, the thing thing cannot come earlier. He sounds. He sounds like Trump. No, um, no, 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 do not insult Trump. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> no, he he's the most sway hang guy in the world, man. It's like wow. He yeah. he actually sounded extremely confused. He, he was like, "Fuck." Okay, like ha- this is what I'm getting ha- from it. Have you ever been in a presentation? Yes, where it's mm. group presentation, yep. and everyone else there is prepared except, except you. Yeah, except me. And yeah, your and the whole way he's still just writing is like we in the East Coast. You <sighs> you know who East I Coast. had in my poly final year project? I had the guy who would just like throw his hands up and stuff, mm. and stuff, and stuff. That's how that, that that's what he does like in the presentation. Yeah, but he got the highest marks. Yeah. What? No, oh, because yeah. he, he he's smart. He's smart, but he's he just smart. can't yeah, like he, speak he publicly. He actually got he lucked out. His group had the yeah. two smartest guy in the in the, in class. the class. Right. The two smartest yeah. mofos in the class. Like, but, but it was it was easy. It was easy. But do you that, think yeah. like for him he should at least just write out like pointers on a card no, and then just look I at it and did. then yeah. I think he did, but he forgot. He forgot to look at it. It looked like when he we the East Coast then he's what did I write? He, like it feels like he's trying to wing it, but um, yeah, he was he winging it. Just fucking <laughs> he <sucks. yeah>. was <laughs> winging it. He was winging it. He, it was more like, as with the title of DPM, right? He was yeah. expected to go anywhere and own it. Right. You know, like okay, let's say you there's a president walking around, and then the vice president is like, and then someone calls out, "Hey, hey, this place, ah, uh, we don't have a viable candidate, you know, and 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 the nomination thing is right now, but we don't have anyone that that's viable. Who, who? Then the president just look. Yeah, this guy. Ooh. Okay, but but who was Go. okay? They are so that they are the, the, they are the I incumbents. I don't even know who is the, PAP, who else is running PAP there. is the incumbent party mm. at um at East Coast, right? Mm. Yep. So WP is running against them. Nicosia. Nicosia is the most prominent 
WP one, Kennedy one there. Most. Yeah. Now it's and James, she, she, now it's James. She jumped now, ships, right? Now she was James, in NSP. Yeah. She was yeah. in National Oh wait, J- James is in East Coast as well. No, James no, 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 is here. No, he's here. Oh. He's here. He's uh, not not here, but in the area. In this constituency. Yeah, yeah so, in Singkang so, East. Singkang GRC. Yeah. Singkang East GRC. So now there's James. What about East? Yeah, yeah, East. They add the East. Ah, really? There's a Singkang West as well. Wow. It's like there's. When did that happen? No, now it's Pong Pasir Ris Pongo. Yeah. Then there's Pongol SMC. Then there's uh, then Sengkang there's East, Sengkang, Sengkang West. GRC. There's, wait, I don't think there's a Sengkang East, Sengkang West, if I'm not wrong. Well, Berlin East, Berlin West. Yeah, yeah. You know, carry on. Let me double, double check. No, East Germany, Germany, West Germany. Germany. East Germany, West yeah, Germany. Yeah, so it, it could be something like that. No? They're like, fuck, we don't have anyone contesting here who's, who's got a name. No, okay. I Nicosia asked you will I have so many horny men yeah, I asked you voting at the for her in the who? East Coast in Badok. Who was the one that uh, runs at uh, East Coast now? Like, who was the incumbent? Oh yeah, yeah, like, Sengkang GRC. Sengkang, Sengkang GRC. GRC. Yeah. Like who's yep. the incumbent at? at That's at, where we are. I have no clue. I have no clue. Can you can you check who were the MPs at East who Coast? Who was the previous like, East Coast GRC? Previous, uh, yeah. yeah. Who was the previous one at East Coast GRC? Like yeah, we are we are missing our fact ch- fact checker here. Okay, uh, wait, wait, yeah. hang on. So there's Pongo West SMC. Yeah. Um, and then there's Pasir Ris Pongo. Yes. Oh, GRC. Oh, that's GRC. Oh, yeah. And, and then, then we Sengkang. have Sengkang GRC. Then there's Amokyo. Yes. And then there's Arjunet. Yeah, but no one cares about those people. No, it it used to be part of this area, no? So they oh, used to it? they used to cut the fucker the pie in oh. such a weird manner. How is Amokyo part of? Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, right. So there's a lot of cutting going around. Like, and then you know. certain parts of Aokang was actually Arjunet. Yeah. It was not even Aokang SMC. And then certain parts of Aokang was part of Amokyo GRC. So you can see the election fever has almost hit us. Like, yeah, I'm still quite indifferent about it. Like, Yours is Ni Soon, right? Yeah, Ni Soon. Like, oh. Indifferent in the are sense you gonna, that... Are you going to be voting for the law? No, because there is for nothing. For K. Shanmugam. So, okay, so there. GE 2015. Mm. PAP returns, uh, retains East Coast GRC with 60.7% yeah. votes. Okay. Who, who so the it? candidates are Mr. Lee... E. Sh- Cheyenne Okay Cheryl Chan uh-huh. Miss Jessica Tan Mr. Mohammed Malik Osman Okay And Mr. Lim Sui Se Oh, Lim Sui Se was the only minister So this fellow was not even part of East Coast yep. GRC he No, wasn't. no, no He was no. Tempanese Tempanese He, he re- used to be Tempanese he, he, yeah. used to, he used to be seated at Tempanese They took him out And replaced him Replaced Lim Sui Se is Lim Sui Se even in the fucking party now? I don't think he, so. I, I, I he, think that's I've why. I've not seen his name though. That, I've not even uh, seen the fella. Dude, yeah. that, that might be why. That might be why because he's out and I think he just had to fill that splot. The, 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 the splot. Yeah, the splot. The splot, huh? not yeah, the, the spot. It's the, it's the spot and the, the, and the, the lot. lot. And the lot, everything yeah, together. And the <laughs> Three okay. words merged Yeah, so one. GRC, uh, Tampanese GRC mm. in 2015 was uh, Minister Heng Sui Ket, mm. uh, Masagos uh, Zul- uh, Zulkifli. Zulkifli. Yeah. So Masagos, ba- I think, is the one running Now for he's the, uh, he's the, the head. Yeah. He's the head, yeah. He's heading that. And then uh, B-A-E-Y, Bay? Bay? Bay B- Yam K- Yang King. I'm, oh, yeah, yeah, Bay Yam King is also one of them. And then um, Desmond Chu and Cheng Li Hui. Cheng Li Hui. Ah. Yeah. So they took him out. So this they, was Tampanese in 2015. And Masagos Zulkifli just fucked it over <laughs> by mm. saying on the rally, saying, please vote for Lee Sien Yang. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Yes. When, when was that? Huh? That was a couple of days ago. Oh, oh shit. And he shit. said, please vote for Lee Sien Yang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, but he, he came out, he came out to say that, um, that uh, Lee Sien Yang used to be his boss when he was a Sing Tao, yeah. Yeah, so that's why he got the names mixed up. But still, that's a big fuck and up. And he la. said that his son sent him a really heavily worded yeah, text because, saying because that you fucked up. Yeah, the yeah. thing is like, Lee Sien Yang could, was your boss, but right now your bigger boss is Lee Sien Long. Yeah. So I think today's episode I think will be like election 2.0 la, from what we no. picked up from what we did last uh, last week okay, because last yeah. week we didn't know uh, what who the nominations yeah. were but now no, we know last week we knew no no but New who's wish. running who's oh, contesting yeah, no, no, it, it, the nominations happened on Tuesday so I'm wrong yeah uh, yeah you are right so we di- we didn't know who were contesting where yeah exactly and but now, now we, we know. know but yep. the thing is right what do you all say I think the PS, uh, PSP the PAP have started out and actually that's quite a clever move on that Tan Cheng Bo- uh, Dr. Tan Cheng Box uh, side yeah. PSP PAP you know very easy to mix them up very easy he to mix them up and Tampanese uh, what, what a Tampanese, nice man yeah. Dr. Yeah. Tan Cheng Bok he walked around came to my home he came into your home 
outside, outside like, 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 he spoke oh shit no no one came to our door dude is it yeah he came with the the candidate who was who's contesting our my area right right dr ang and uh that that nomination video is actually fucking funny as well mm. so we have the um, the former the the first ever female general mm. Gun, we say or something. Uh, Gun, I mm. I know I know her name is Gun. Yeah. So she is uh contesting my area, Marymount SMC. So, <laughs> um, so they did the same thing, but because it's a SMC, right? So the only one candidate. So she had two, kakiyan with her. Yeah. Who just stood be- behind beside her beside her and behind, while she gave her fucking her speech nomination her. speech, yeah. and it sounded like someone talking to subordinates. Oh, that's the that's the one that has a gif of uh, of like the army like marching and all yes. that kind of shit. The people yeah. are getting so ready for people, war. People are fucking yes. wrecking her yeah, on yeah. Tri- Straight Times and Chinese Asia on Facebook because they're like, "What the fuck is this? I need to wake up at five in the morning and do five BX." I think after I listen to this, dude, that's what, I you, get, sign that's extra what you get when you get someone from the army. Yes, that's how they no, gonna, she, that, Air Force. I think she was how, a former no, pilot. That's how they. That's how they. That's. In yeah, green. F- straight from the military, right? So it so sounded like she was talking to subordinates. No, the and then after that, mm. the PSP candidate came on with his two kakia, and there were like a group. Dear were, re- ah, yes, yeah, yeah, this one. of Marymount Is SMC, really like I'm Gan yeah. Xiao Huang. Gan Xiao Thank Huang. you for your support. The other lady there is a lawyer. Maybe well. a new SMC, but many of you have lived here for a long time. <laughs> PAP MPs have been serving you, you and walking with you, you the no, journey dude. right oh, from I feel the like start. I should be standing at Every time she said we you, right? Yeah, I just want to stand up straight. And most yeah. beautiful so sit up straight. In Singapore. Chest forward, like this, shoulders right? back. We have forged strong so community you. bonds through the years. That's the eyes Vote of a killer. PAP so that we can continue to serve you. Vote for PAP so that together we can build a better future. Alright, uh, now it's Chinese. Shut the fuck up. No, but, but yeah. then, the moment she said you, I want to just stand up and salute. It, and just like hands it, it straight to the... It didn't sound like a request. It, sound, it sounds like a fucking threat. Yeah. No, it, yeah, yeah. it sounds... And all okay. the inflictions on the you. Do you, do you not, do you <laughs> not you. recognize where this comes from? It, this is exactly how it sounds like. I feel like, like I'm doing army. reservice right yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. is like when the when the when the when the command the CEO it's is out there and saying like, our outline for this uh, s- uh, commander this, APGC. Yeah, it was like yeah, uh, yeah. this reservice. The goal is to ingratiate former, all former of you uh, uh, to, to 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 have all of you ready for war. Yeah, yeah. You know, it it's either the army or uh, S and M bedroom. No, <laughs> or in an S and M bedroom. Yeah, that's so yeah. you. S- kneel over and show me the ass so I can yes. whip you. Whip, but yeah, yeah. I she know. she was just missing a few things lah from the speech. Empathy. Uh, no, she was missing um the leather leather jacket, the latex uh outfit. Maybe a paddle, your, your, your a paddle mind, on the right hand. Your, your mind is now fixated on the BDSM a, side. A of paddle it. on the hand, so she can like spank. No, she's <laughs> <laughs> she, she's uh, missing the lan lan saktam. Oh and yeah, a few of the other army lingos that do know, anything but don't, don't get, get caught. caught uh. Yeah, do anything, yeah. don't get caught. Yeah, the thing is that how do you, how do you, how do you? Uh, Even though she was in the Air Force, oh Air Force, so nine how, SAF nine core values. How do you? Oh, she's in Air Force. Yeah, she, she was, was a fucking general, general in the Air Force. There, but did she visit our camp at, at Sambong Air Base? She was a commander after. Uh, after I think Subjit Singh or someone right. else, she took. Right, over. Right, she right. was a uh, commander APGC. If I'm not wrong, no, it's, yeah. it's so, worrisome uh, that you can't relate you to know, any of them. It's it's yep. it's, it's worri- worrisome that, that there's such a disconnect. Like if, if I'm not wrong, she was a pilot. If I'm not oh, wrong, oh okay, she okay. Was a F, uh, then cre- pilot. hats off to that though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. hats no, off to that. No, no, that that is that is perfect. That's yeah, but, but can I just say that being a security trooper in an Air Force base, I take my job very seriously. <laughs> and if she comes in in the car, I'm going to body search. Oh, you had to. If I, not, I would have given you an extra. <laughs> you have gone, you have I'll be like, you know, I'll, I'll just pass. like radio demon, demon. Yeah. I think, well, uh, the general is here. I'm going to body search her. Please come and watch me do my job. <laughs> With a video camera. <laughs> but oh, Make her so walk through the... No, if, if she was a general... No, we should not talk about the protocols. But the, the thing is that this whole, this whole shit, right, was like, you want to canvas votes like this? Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit... That, that, 
immediately when I was watching this uh, on Tuesday afternoon, right? Yeah. Having the double down zinger, the first one. And uh, I was like laughing at this. And then after this, the PSP candidate came through. Mm. And holy fuck, how fun was that guy? Let's play that part. Uh, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah he, the, the fella, he just did not give two shits. He didn't give a fuck. He was just there to fuck things up. Oh, uh, this guy. Where, where is, it's a, uh, the guy in the hat. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So just skip to the other part, like the skip to the part where... Yeah, uh, you can skip to the... When he comes in, hey everybody, all you, no, 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 no. hey, like no, yeah, we can like, see that's the thing. She's so stoic and so rigid and so rigid and 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 and, 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 st- and like yeah, and, and the fact that her hands are by her side, not no um, moving, it, no, yeah, no, it, no expression. It, it, we we talk with our hands, right? And the fact that your hands are by your side look makes you look very stiff, because as human beings, we usually like you know emphasize things with our hands. Yeah, but no, it, she feels like she's giving commands to like people the on the ground. Commands is it's it's scripted and. Uh, it's so impersonal. I was like, "Whoa." Okay, and then, and then now you, and then now, the the PSP guy comes in, and and you watch this. Hey, 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 you skip the bit. You skip the bit. Ah. Oh, whoa. At, at first, uh, at first, right, I was like, "Who is this Ape?" <laughs> because he was like, <laughs> he's just tapping the mics. Yeah. You walk on the stage, tap the mics. Dear fellow Singaporeans. And voters of Marymount, I am Dr. Ang Yong Guan. Please vote for us. Get us into Parliament. We want to deny PAP the two-third majority. That was enough. That <laughs> sold me <laughs> on everything that this man stood for. When he said that, I was like, "How fucking honest can a man get?" Yeah. Yeah, he that's true. He did not say. He did not say anything flowery nothing he just greeted the people yeah and he was please vote for us so, so we that we can deny, deny them <laughs> PAP two like, thirds majority fucking straight to the point man send 32 of us PSP plus alternative parties to get into parliament this guy has no foreplay straight Not to the act straight, straight to the act Hands down. Yeah, bend I mean, over, uh, let, bend me, over let me bang you. Spit and, on the fucking cop. No, no spit sit, at all. No, my, no, no, he, he spat. He oh, spat. He spat. No, you know why? He gave chance for the other parties. Oh, okay. No, he said enough. vote for the alternative parties. But, right, right. Fair but enough. Comparison. Side by side comparison. Rigidity versus flu. You look, you look at how high his hand <laughs> Yeah. His hands were all the way to the top. Straight up. He's to the emphasizing top. with his hands. Yeah. yeah. That's what she should have done. It's just, 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 you, can, you, you can see yourself in him. You can see like... That's the image of a leader. Look at that. Yeah. You with a bit of a pot belly, I, you know, I wouldn't uh, say someone who's I, like I comfortable in his skin. Leader. I wouldn't say... Go, I can't tell anything about his competency. He's, he's my leader. Do not <laughs> do not shit insult about my leader. Uh, Mary Mount. I, I don't care about that, but I can't tell anything about his competency. Right now, he's just spewing stuff that is attractive to the populace. Okay. Ah, 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 ah. Uh, but but I, what what I'm going on is that if I had to compare the two of them, he is more amiable. I can relate to him better right. than I can okay, do. Okay, let's talk about credentials the then. Yeah, let's this go. This man, yes, served in the army, retired as a colonel. Oh really? Okay. Wow. Uh, army psychiatrist, chief psychiatrist. Impressive. Wait, can we play the for, rest of it first? For army, right? And now he's got something. a private practice at Paragon. Nice, yeah. For country, for people, you deserve better. Ching Ai de. Oh, he switched to men. Okay, no, that's for. Oh, he was yeah. short and sweet. Yeah, short yeah. and sweet with uh, buzzwords hitting all the right notes, you know. Enhance. Enhance no, and I fist. G- I give him fist props. Fist in the air, you know, you gotta. I give him props because when he came up there, right, he. I. I I know I, I don't know relate but I can just like And you wow. see he's got one guy working at Stickies with him <laughs> another guy from no, the I fucking mean, management at uh one of if, the condos If I had to put them side <laughs> by side right if I didn't put side by side I would say yeah. I was comparing a robot to a person Yeah mm. yeah 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 I would yeah. compare someone who had a script to come out and say like this is the things to say to inspire uh leadership to, to, to gain obedience yeah. Obedience The first one was obedience The second like one you listen to me And no one else The second right? one That's was what more, she's saying Yeah, yeah The second like one was more, more like uh, You know Honest fo- Follow, follow Honest, me yeah. For the betterment of yourself Because yeah. I want to lead you Somewhere better The other one was like Listen to me 
and I will and I will guarantee that I will bring you to somewhere. The first better. one looks like she's reading from a teleprompter. Yeah. I mean, look at how this we guy, are right now. Yeah. If we had followed her, right, mm-hmm. all of us would be here. And, and wh- sitting up what's this guy's name sorry Dr. Ang so uh, Dr. Ang looks like actually he's speaking from his heart yeah you know uh, and he was just one rank away from her he yeah. retired as a full colonel well, yeah, rank, yeah. ranks aside I think you just pointed out a really good thing where he he, he clearly stated like the one thing we do our goal here is to deny the incumbent the that blank check the authority. super majority the blank check yeah. Yeah. the authority and, and I mean Honestly, I have been for that because it, uh, it's faster. You don't have to go through all the you know the shit. Yeah. And it's because I've been uh one thing is because I've been. I've I've seen how things are in America where you have a two party thing or uh, like a two party stuff. It's mm-hmm. slow, and I I I saw it there as like yeah it's a bit too slow you know if you have one party things will be faster if the party say something it will but go is through. but you know that's but another you, question but is you it open slow it because for, of the two parties yeah but you or, open or it to you know to 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 um, abuse because if mm. one party says it's okay it goes through no matter what no yeah. one can say anything and uh, no one can say anything else and now I've realized stop using America as an example because they're fucked up. It's a fucked up policy to follow them at any mm. point. They've proven it time and time again. They're not the idealistic society you want to be. They spout so much nonsense about being free, but what they really are are people who just like to abuse Yeah, yeah, but, kind of we're, but we're talking about Singapore politics yeah, here. Yeah. Singapore? So, so now my, my question is, which of the candidates would you want to see in a latex outfit in your bedroom? Oh, for uh, Dr. Ang. <laughs> 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 what about Nicosia? She She's pretty fine. Latex outfit. Yeah, latex outfit with a panel in hand. I, I think we need to record uh, like a separate disclaimer for this episode. No? Right. Saying that we, it's which you have to edit and put right at the front. <laughs> like, w- we don't Saying that this podcast is just is just for jokes. Yeah. Do, do not take us seriously. Do not, you know, it's not meant to be taken seriously. Yep. And if you are going to be taking things seriously, please skip this episode. Yeah. This is a comedy podcast. We don't mean what we say. We're just talking shit. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. So don't be, uh, if you're offended, then just turn it off. I mean, Except for uh, me uh, voting uh, for uh, Doctor. You're you're, yeah. you're here to listen. That is to us Just <laughs> rant about things we we find funny. I don't find this whole yeah. Yeah. really really funny. And right? if you don't find it funny, no, okay, but, it's fine. But one it's thing fine. I one thing I respect about Nicosia is that she left after the 2015 right or 2011. 2011. 2011. She left. She went private practice, and then now she came back to run for. WP. Yeah. Now she's with WP. Uh, East Coast. Yeah. Previously, oh, she was in. But fuck! But what, what was the um, fucking candidate for NSP that I sent you guys? Kevin. 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 She's not running. Kevin or some shit like She's not running. If she was, she can run anywhere. I would chase her. Yeah. We'll, oh yeah, yeah. Oh no, yeah, that one, that one. But yeah, the thing that, is, yeah. the thing is, we have so. So many what a smoke show that. that okay, one. so so who is she though? Is she like she's NSP, working in NSP. the NSP uh NSP yeah, party, but she's yeah. not running for any you, you, uh. You she was. She was trying to run. You guys got my right. hopes up, and because. NS- so so uh, what happens if NSP NSP so what happens if NSP wins like uh, uh I think NSP is only contesting at one I think one. GRC or some sh- some shit like that or they are barely contesting. Right? No, I feel I that I yeah. Nisun is being she contested by NSP. Is it Nisun? Or, is or is it PSP? I I can't remember. But e- either way, you know the thing is, the thing is the consolidation of all the opposition could be in consideration if you mm. took if you take the brightest ones of your opposition party and form them under a singular opposition, you might have an actual fight. Yeah, but you, you've got to consider one thing. They have they different are, egos. They are, they are in no, different parties because they've got different ideology and different, different worldview. Agendas, yeah. different man- manifestos. But the, yeah. the, the, that's, the, that's the question there. It's like you have so many... Not including that different egos no, as well. No, yes. The egos and everything apart is that if there was a definite problem with the incumbent party, everyone would be consolidated. No, not necessarily. Because they have different solutions for the problems. And and I, I actually I no, kinda see, like it that way though. Yeah, that we have yeah. more than there, there's not just a two party like fighting each other, that we have uh WP, we have uh SDP, we have NSP, we have PSP, like different people well, offering I, different solutions. I, I, to I the don't problem. see it that way. And I then you have it, my PP. I see it right. <laughs> I see it is that if you think there is a definite yeah. uh, problem with the incumbent mm-hmm. and you might have your different opinions about it. But you can consolidate and discuss it amongst yourself. 
Yeah, but you see, the, the thing, would, the would thing it make is, more sense? No, the thing is, the thing is, that's why there's so many separate is because of ego and the wanting to take over that mm. power for your own self. And that worries me because that shouldn't be the case. The case for the opposition was, al- was always to be make to make it better for the people. That you yeah. can see some, there's a problem with yeah. the incumbent and you want to fix it. But even though you have so many different ways of fixing it, you can come amongst you, you can get amongst yourself and formulate something you can all I mean you might want to try to give okay. agree on but, but here's the thing though like even between the three of us here right we have different solutions to the same problem like that would be the same like any problem right like you know like whatever happens in Singapore or like in the political realm or yeah, whatever like you see pineapple on a pizza fucking cane the person yeah but then someone else like are you fine with pineapple on pizza yeah. is it yeah exactly right so between the three of us we disagree on like small things so if you but you see now now then we have to discuss is pineapple on pi- pizza a big problem yes so yeah. No, is so it yeah, so all the op- all the opposition is, is it a big enough problem for us to splinter our 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 That's how different parties start. You see that's yeah. the thing. No, I, I'm using I, that I, as I, a I metaphor. Know, it's like if you want to if you want to splinter a party yeah. that's the thing, but that does that solve the bigger problem like do you, is uh, the pineapple on pizza such a big problem that it needs to be solved that you need so many parties to solve it? Yeah. Or the thing is that is the pineapple but so detrimental that gathering up like the two of you mm. like I'm a PAP and I say pineapple and pizza is the way to go and see, see you think pineapple and pizza are not the way to go you um, I'll just remove the pineapple and eat the pizza and throw the pineapple at an uh, ugly person so, so there's see, a difference so there yeah. now the two yeah. of you can come together and no. Start, no, no I say that there has to be caning he says no, no, that no, no, I, I don't I believe in violence I don't he believe says violence. that ah, I will ah, throw away the pineapple this is, yeah. this is where I'm going to so I believe that. in ridicule <laughs> <laughs> I need to ridicule an, uh, a fugly person a fat and ugly person and throw the pineapple that at that we person agree yeah, so, so, yeah. So, so, see that's where I'm going I'll on. throw so, the pineapple at that person uh, like <laughs> I'm I'm the incumbent and I say pineapple on pizza is fine yeah yeah. And the two of you are in disagreement with like yeah, I but don't I'll, I don't like pineapple yeah. on pizza. I don't like pineapple on pizza. But our solutions like, are different. Both of you right? don't like pineapple on pizza. Our solutions, solutions are different. Are different. Yeah. And because your solution is different, that's why you splinted out. Yes. But I'm gonna win because you splinted out so much that pineapple on pizza is still gonna be the majority. Yeah, but because it's not enough just to disagree with you, the next step is that I want to get elected, right? To take over you. Mm. So see, see. Uh, wait, wait. Okay. So, I would have to present some form of solution, right? Mm-hmm. So that is where the roadblocks are at. My solutions are not going to fucking go anywhere close to him because he does not want mm-hmm. violence for people people who like pineapples on pizza. He's fine with everyone ordering pineapples on pizza. Just but remove he's it just if you don't like remove yeah. it. Right? So that's a different thing. Mm. And you want pineapples completely gone from pizza? Yes, and if anyone orders it, I want them to be caned. So you see, yeah. but the thing so is then we will never agree to we fight will you. Never agree. No, we will. I, I will fight you individually. He will fight individually. Individually, but and we'll never have comes, form a coalition. If a case happens where, if we have both gotten into the parliament, and you have also gotten yourself into the parliament, mm. but now you have you are struggling to form majority, a majority government, right? Yeah. Now we might talk. Hmm. Or well, now. But then that's We are so all in parliament already But there's so much discourse Now then. we might talk yeah. No, but now we might talk And we might form Our own uh, Our majority government But there's so yeah. much discourse In between So much time wasted Trying to form there, There's that, no time wasted We have cut out That whole time Negotiating with no, things That's what you say we now We have put but, ourselves but your negotiations You couldn't come to a negotiation Before the Because the I, I, I think You're coming mm. to a negotiation Only after you're in party Which is wasting a lot no, of because, time In parliament Because to before I form part. A coalition with Deben I need to see that Whether his views Sit with the majority Of Singaporeans Who accept him right Who yeah. accept him Being in parliament if if he is and I am as well, okay, maybe case, let, that, we have that. a following. Okay, let's come to a middle ground. But if before that happens, right, then there's nothing much that we can yeah. we can the, the, the talk ca- about. The case is that if the majority of Singapore was with him, he would be in power. No, I didn't run for a thing or anything. What? Right? No, no, I, no, you see, you're, no. You're, you're running against me. You're, you're yeah, putting out the part that pineapple shouldn't be on pizza. If the majority of Singaporeans was with you, they would have voted you in. Okay, no. wait. Let, let let's start from from the start, right? The, 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 okay. The, the, that's the thing. You see, that's where I'm, the, the splintering is just an ego race. It's 
you want your policy to come in place mm. and you want your policy to come in place but my but, policy but, uh, is but in that, place that, but that might not be about ego that might be no, about but why what can't you think why can't would be right you, for the people why can't the two of you come together and find the middle ground and fight this one as a 50 like, like a 50 like, I'm mm. just asking that point I'm not yeah. I'm not saying yeah. it's wrong I'm just yeah. saying why can't the oppositions come together form a stronger coalition and fight against the incumbent for the betterment of the people uh, uh, why do you have to be why does it you, you uh, see you see where i'm coming from is yeah. that i don't want an opposition to come in just to fuel their own agenda i'm just re- that means i'm replacing an incumbent with a different with a different form of power i'm replacing the PA, uh, pap with someone else that wants to push their own agenda through It's not my agenda. It's just that they want to be in power for that reason. I I want someone to come in together and say like, "Hey, there really is a problem there." Mm. And if there really is a problem there, I don't see why the oppositions can't come together and find a solution because that, together. No, no, together. No, no, But no, no, when no. you're saying to because we have a different solution. If you have a different solution, then the one in power already has a fixed solution. He has the idea of everyone I, in. Why should I listen to you and you when you can't agree amongst yourself? I think, but I think we can all agree that Trump 2020. Yeah, that's Trump 2020. <laughs> but yeah. no, no, I, know, back. I understand you're trying to distract me from the thing, but that's where I'm coming from. Like saying, if the opposition really has the but the, Sean, the if they all could agree with each other from the beginning, there will be no splintering. There, there will be no splintering. They yeah. will be all one party. But that's not how things work. Yeah. I think no, they have fundamental differences. That's why yes. they speed. No, speed let's up. see. They they might have fundamental yeah. di- differences, but I'm saying that if they if they but overcome okay, the fundamental, wouldn't they? No, no, but, he, but they won't. They won't. No, but here's a good thing though. That that's one thing I like because they're not pretending yes. that they're together as one coalition. I didn't ask them well, to pretend. Okay. No, no, no. no but yeah. at least they're right from the clear start. Right when we vote them, we know that these parties, even their opposition, they disagree with PAP. But at least they have their own values. It, it is good to disagree. They, yeah, they it have their good. own worldview, their I, own okay, ideology. You, you see, Now you're acting. The thing is like, oh, you shouldn't. Dis- you know, wh- where everybody's focused on is like, if you disagree with the thing, you're for your pro PAP, you're p- for the thing. I'm just saying that I would better okay. be a good, okay. encouraged a to, good. A, a, to to to. Uh, okay, to I'll use an example. Good example, Malaysia. So yeah. in the past election, well, I right? I think they're a great example. No, this is what you are talking about. Yeah. Mm. So in the past election, people were all. Fucking upset with Najib. Oh, you the mean whole talk- scandal you're talking thing. about the consolidation over there? Yes. Okay. So, what happened was that different parties came together, and they were like, "Let's form a coalition." Right. D A okay. P. Be- before uh, you go, then all the different parties, right? P K R and all, and then they formed the coalition. I, if I'm not wrong, it might. Uh, uh, I think Pakatan Harapan. I understand right? where you're going. You're you're saying because they co, they 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 formed that coalition and now they split up because there was still that. There was still that splinter within the group. They only co. No, no, it was not a splinter. It was not a splinter within the group. I, no, but they coalesced yeah. only so, so for the, the main purpose the goal to that overthrow they all, the, the no the the, the goal right? that they all set out for each other mm. was not met. Because they formed the party, they formed yeah. the majority government, right? Because Amno uh, Barisan National d- could not form the government, so these guys had majority. They formed the government, and they had Mahathir Mohamad at the top, and. Um, They had all the different party people, like all the different leaders of the different parties within the coalition, to assume key positions within the cabinet, and eventually things fell apart. Okay, you know, no, no, you no, know no, why? No, no, you know no, why? You're using a bad example to 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 say why that won't. But you see, the basis of that was the opposition still didn't agree how they solved the. No, they issues. agreed on certain no, things. No, no, that means they agreed on a false basis. They agreed to it just to form a coalition mm-hmm. to get into power, and then they split up because they couldn't. Yeah, they, so, they so I think what still didn't agree. Yeah, like so what still I think didn't agree so what Devon's point is is that even if all the opposition in Singapore form a coalition, it's going to be like this because fundamentally they they they, they believe in different things. The, the thing is that's forming it on a pretense. Yeah, but Sean, you want them to no, form no, no. it without the pretense, is it? I don't. I want them to. Why? Of course, I want to. But form that's them not going to happen. That's what I'm saying. No, yeah. Now you're saying it's not going to happen. You see. I'm not saying that's. I'm not saying that I I want it to happen because I'm saying you're saying it's not going to happen. But you look at it uh, this way: if they formed it mm. based on the non-pretense, would that not work? Uh, that would be you, the ideal you situation. You just uh. you just yeah. agreed that if no, they formed, be the ideal I know they formed it or not, and that's what I'm not seeing. There's like so you're, you're, saying, you're hoping like that they you're will. You're just saying yeah, there's a splinter because they can't agree, and I'm saying that if they could 
actually agree on right a, right uh, on a proper solution yeah. it would work but right. the reason why you're looking at so many different opposition is because they can't agree on a proper solution right mm. and that shows that all their solutions all that bickering is all based on what because this guy sees it one way that guy wants. so is that problem unsolvable with so many solutions right if that so that problem can be solved by one solution shouldn't they all come to the same conclusion like I, i'm just saying that like mm. like let's just say um well, let's say jobs mm. if that if the opposition came to a proper like we can we can solve jobs using this way and that guy has one idea this guy has one idea that guy is so none of those op- none of those ideas are actually in a sense very viable that's why you have three different three or four different solutions mm. so the current pap has this 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 way of solving it and then one two three now if i saw that one two three were all the same like they mm. can say solve together then i know that the incumbent have has a very flawed notion of it in a sense ah. but now i have four different solutions to it and this one is concerned that his solution is better than this one and that one is and th- that split causes that um, for me is the the problem that why should i vote for you when the incumbent has shown that they've you know they've gotten like things in check it it falls on one person to prove without a doubt that they can solve it better than the rest and I find it very hard because I don't have I I I don't know how to phrase okay I don't phrase things mm. very well, but what I'm saying is that because there's a split on that solution, right? Mm. I can't fo- I can't follow the opposition because it is not a definite that there is a problem. It's just to me, it's just that he wants to point it out because he wants to get in power, mm. and if that's a ten percent problem, there is that. That there, there is that, that mistake that I'm only voting you in because think that you know is this popularity vote like I don't want to think but if you come in power you could mess it up even more. Now if I saw that all five of you have this, like the same kind of strong thing, that it's a bigger impetus for me that like hey, there really is a mm. issue and they actually have a they they have a solid. But like, do problems only have one solution? No, no, th- th- that's. Th- th- I think that's the most th- important that's question. One thing right that there. problems don't have one solution. Yeah. But uh, this isn't one thing where I- we can try out. How would you know if those solutions were never tried out? No, that's the thing. We have five different other solutions. Yeah, but if they, I had, they a, all a, might if work I had an alternative, to degrees, if I had an alternative one mm-hmm. to go for, mm-hmm. I would want to go for the one that has a a better degree of success. But no, which, which one? Which one would you deem as better degree I, of success? I, 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 when only one has been implemented and the other four have not been. No, that's the thing. You gave me four other implement, and I yeah. only have a choice. One choice. Yeah. So it's I down to your choice. Yeah. The thing is that, uh, it, it, I mean, it shouldn't be so simple that if I choose that guy, it's definitely gonna work. I I need something more viable. I, n- I no, need it's, something. It's for up to you to choose which solution you deem fit to choose yeah, right now uh, what, and if, what, what, it what succe- if it succeeds it succeeds if it fails you take responsibility but I don't want I don't want it to fail I can't I, it's a country thing I, it, it's a whole country it's, if it fails it hurts us okay, all okay you see Arjunit GRC has been under WP since 2011 right mm. and if, if I'm not wrong yeah has Singapore failed no they have encountered quite a number of no, problems. No, 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 you, ca- you can't use that one because no, Singapore no, they have not enc- no, no, they're no, not. I'm talking about Arjunit GRC, right? Have the people suddenly, all of a sudden, over the past il- nine years, but you have to talk about have the change. They, have they have experienced the change. such a what drastic change? change? Happened there? Was no, w- have, have they experienced such a drastic change in their standard of living? What was the change? See, I'm not arguing for the opposition. I'm not arguing for the incumbent. I'm saying that. If there was such a, a need for change in government, that the opposition would be in solidarity. If there was such a big ass problem in the PA, PAP, that the the opposition would come together solid in Actually, a solidarity. Uh, no, th- th- so, that, that, so here's that, the thing. I'm I'm going to push back on your idea mm. fundamentally because I feel that firstly, 
all of them disagree fundament politically fundament fundamentally and I prefer it that way because right from no, the no. start we understand that Kay. where they're coming from so rather than them form- forming a coalition just to overthrow a PAP and then fight in parliament no, yeah. no. The, 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 so, okay. so I, I'm, I'm arguing on the fact that it's better now that we see different parties and we clearly understand their different points of view different diff- policies different, yeah and, and, and where I, we can get to choose and ideally right like okay like, sidetrack a bit like you know where we saw the the, 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 the debate on uh, Facebook yeah uh, Facebook live and we see the three different parties and PAP right mm. and very clearly like five minutes into the into the yeah, de- you debate see you see that th- it's three against one I, I think like uh, no no the, the, for the first topic and then after that you could see that each better. of them, right, they have their own point of view. Yes. Chi Soon John, right, was like the radical there. And then you had Jameis, yeah. who was like trying to be sensible, trying to, to come up with yeah, a yeah. very, very clean cut mm. and all. And then the PSP, I think his name was what, Kenneth or something? Yeah, like it was quite quiet. He was, no, but then he he agreed with Jameis, he agreed with Chi yeah. Soon John on one point. Yeah. So, but here's the thing, I think ideally, where Singapore, I, I feel like, in the next, like maybe the next election or something where we have this debate, we will see uh, more opposition seats in the parliament and then all four of them will be challenging each other viewpoint rather than just three opposition challenging the PAP viewpoint yes. and then agreeing with each other. But I, I feel I, that I, that dialogue, right, will benefit Singapore in the long run rather than all like all the opposition form together a coalition and then just challenge PAP. When we when when you know right from the outset that like WP SDP uh, PSP all have fundamentally different viewpoints, uh, but did mm. you think about this or not, Sean? Like the point that you were making, where the opposition actually come together without any ego, right? No, no, no. Uh, okay, like I if think, if, if they maybe, they find that the maybe, PAP maybe I'm not explaining myself properly. Yeah. I I don't want a two party fight. Yeah, but then you were I d- I for the two, a, fo- two I don't party want fight. I want a two party fight. Yeah. In the for the sake of a two party fight, mm. I want a clear case where if the incumbent party is doing something wrong, the opposition party should come to like if it's such a mistake, mm. then I don't see why the opposition can come together to fight that one point together. You understand uh, what I see now no, is a splintering. They, they, what technically, I, they're what, fighting it together, what, but they're just in okay, different constituencies. Uh, I mean, this di- different thing is like if they really want to win that, if it's such a big problem, I don't see why it's so hard to come together and fight that one thing. Okay, I'm speaking on a more. I'm not pretending to be very intellectual on this mm. thing. I'm just saying that on the simplest. Is there thing, a specific like like thing that uh, that you feel that? People I don't know. Specific but, but policy. Or? No, you see, when we watched the video, there, right? There no Doctor speci- Ang was was fighting together. No, he said that, vote for okay, the alternative okay, that, parties. That, that's 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 that's. Um, I I don't want to say this like because uh, maybe I'm not very good at explaining. But I'm saying if there is really a big big ass problem in the thing, I don't mm. see why the opposition have to have their own way to to get because people thing. think differently. Yeah, mm. uh, and and if it's really for the betterment of us, yeah, they could put that aside. No, but then the solutions might be different. Early on, I just asked you the question, right? Mm. Is there only one solution for a problem? No, there might be five, there might be six, there might be ten. Yeah. So, like, you you say that you want, let, let's say you want to ban pineapples or pizza. Both of us will agree, no, there should be a choice. But Deben wants to whip the people who buys pineapples on pizza. Yeah. And I'm like, let's not whip them, but throw pineapples at their face instead. So yeah, ana- we, another yeah, person might say we, that, no, 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 come on. Everyone yeah. has a freedom to choose, but... Okay, we, I also don't like pineapple. So we all agree that we shouldn't ban pineapples on pizza, but our the end goal is different. Yeah. You know what I mean? So mine would be like the extremely like yeah. v- extreme position where, you know, I and don't want pineapples at all in a, in a uh, pizza hut or whatever. And I feel it's more honest if all of us show our hands clearly yes. from the start than for us to band together in a coalition, but we all have different agendas in the end. You know, yeah. and then the public don't don't really they know don't, about they it. Don't, they don't know. Really they don't know, know about yeah. it. Okay, yeah. but then the, the ones explode in uh, ex- exposed in what Malaysia did lah. That they went together, they won, and then suddenly they splintered back out lah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I can see that point. Yeah. Like because my point was like, if I always saw it like, like if, if there was really something fundamentally wrong with the incumbent, there shouldn't be an issue where the the opposition can come together and fight at one point. The solution should be quite clear cut that, mm. that that there is only one way or there there needs to be that change. Regardless of how I see that the five different ways I, I see about it, we can still discuss that, but we need to change something about the incumbent right yeah. now. And that's the only way we can win 
by binding together instead of splitting it out. Because if you split it out, you lower your chances of winning anything. I can add to that though. Like, it, you see, it's not necessary for the opposition to be mm. all under one banner for the general public to realize that they are not happy with the, incum- the incumbent. They can still acknowledge that there are different parties with different points of view mm. Mm. who are all against the incumbent because they all believe that the incumbent is not serving the general public in its best manner or to the general public's um, benefit. Mm. And they can still vote either the incumbent or the opposition or party that incumbent. is. There's only one constituency with uh, a multi, uh, multi-party uh, competition. That's Pasiris Pongo with three yeah. parties. Yeah. That's the only one constituency, if I'm not wrong. Mm. The rest are all one on one. Yeah. So it's very simple. It's incumbent or opposition. That's it. Yeah. So there's no real need for a formal coalition or what, or, or something like that. And the fact that all the opposition g- kind of like got together and like you know discuss and yeah, how they were like, oh, you are standing here. We won't. We, yeah, we, we won't contest. We will contest. contest on the other like GRC. You, you think you got chance or not? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Then we. we that itself go. is some form of like working yeah. together, la, I feel. Yeah, they are doing it behind closed doors or you know behind the scenes, but they they Being know smart what also. to do. Yeah, they know what to do. Yeah, yeah uh, but this election, I'm quite happy that the opposition has fielded more quality candidates. Mm. Mm. But I, that yeah. one I also have to say, the WP has been quite impressive with their uh, with their selections. Yes. Uh, the rest Except for the uh, one girl Study with me The, the rest <laughs> The rest The rest are not so Which sure Which we shall not name The rest of them I'm not so Not too sure Tanjim Bok Actually does stand chance. Whichever his one Whichever one He's con- uh, competing Where is Tanjim Bok uh? Uh, West, sure. ah, West Coast West yeah. Coast So two ministers At a firing range la. As Israel And uh, Heng Sui Kiat Oh. West Coast and East Coast. Uh, has not West side, East side might be not West side. <laughs> has, has not a lot to win from that one. I think I've seen yeah. it before. Like, he got thrown into that one and his only outcome, the only acceptable outcome for him is to win. Anything yeah, less is. than the 60... Well, you said they won 60.7, is it? Yeah, yeah, I think so. If he gets less but than that... But that, that was with Lim Sui Se, yeah. right? So if he yep. gets less than that... Ooh, already coming uh, coming under scrutiny. Like, is that a way to is that a ploy to get him out of uh, prime minister seat and like Chan Chun Seng? Wait, so wait. is it clear that Lee Kuan Yew will uh, Lee Kuan Yew is dead, lah? <laughs> is it quite clear that Lee Hsien Long will uh, step down as prime minister? I think he that's he what he said. To, I think he that's wants what he to said. step down. Yeah. yeah, he might be because of health. He's gotten really skinny. But Lee Kuan Yew did say that he yeah, might rise, he might rise <laughs> from the dead if he, Singapore is going down. <laughs> there the might be a resurrection. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. I the uh, the Lee second Sien coming. Lee Sien was quite disappointing. I thought he'll be running, but I guess yeah. it's a it's a it's a good move on his part because haven't and really and seen him in a political. And there scene. were a couple of articles from like foreign media mm. actually questioning why Dharman Chandramukhanam is not being considered for the PM. He doesn't want. And there was like a slew of Indian people on Facebook, like mm. fucking uh reposting it like. Like fucking posting no, but it, he and didn't like want it. Yes, he has. And he, he has he taken up. He has taken up a position in uh, IMF and the World Bank as well. Right? Yeah, yeah. For to head up a report, uh, is the committee is for a report recently. Just, mm. ju- I think it just happened, right? But the funny thing was that the party contesting against the PAP in Ju- in Jurong is called Red Dot United. <laughs> yeah, who the fuck are they? Though? That sounds like a football club. A Sunday League football club. Yes, exactly. Red Dot? Red Dot Singapore. Did you know there's a brewery called Red Dot. Yeah, but what? Yeah. Wait, no, no, who, I, I understand what because Singapore is like a Red Dot on the map, but... Yeah, yeah. Okay, there, there, there's another one called People's Voice. People's Voice is led by Lim Tian. That guy has been a dissident for a very long time. He was part of another opposition party. It's time to PP. Uh, yeah, and he left. Um, and then he has been making videos on... Um, which were being circulated by quite a number of Singaporeans on WhatsApp and Lin on YouTube. Tian, his name's quite familiar. Yeah, though. and so Has he been he sued or something before. I think so. He's a he's a lawyer, but um. And then there was like a rumor saying that he's he has filed for bankruptcy or some shit yeah. like that, which he said that has been cleared. You know, everything mm. has been settled. So th- those are just fucking malicious lies. Right. Verbatim, I'm quoting him verbatim, but. <laughs> this guy is well spoken, but I don't know lah. He is contesting in Jalan Besar, right, against Josephine Teo. SMC, right? 
No, Jalan Besar GRC. GRC. So uh, it's four four member GRC. Right, right. So um, I don't know what kind of reception Josephine Teo is going to get mm. because people were saying that. You know, I saw a couple of um, comments saying that we can get rid of her and we can make babies anywhere. The space yes. will be yeah, yeah. We should say that Singaporeans don't need a lot of space to make babies, right? Yeah. And then on uh, Facebook, a lot of people are sending in memes of like staircases, Stack- like yeah. void decks, like behind a rubbish bin, that kind of shit. Yeah. Uh, she was my MP, like, and she, uh, in my opinion, she was useless. Yeah. 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 And uh, the way she handled herself in the parliament when um, uh, I think she was questioned, right? Like, would you um apologize mm. to the foreign domestic wor- uh, foreign workers? Who are being held up in all the dormitories? Mm. Would would you apologize to them that you have let them down in terms of maintaining um, hygiene standards yeah. in the dormitories? Not the personal hygiene, right? Mm. But we're the one, the only ones that have a toilet break that's on camera. Yeah, no, uh, Joe Rogan has that as well. Yeah, is it? Yeah, while it's all running. Yeah, oh. but uh, yeah, but just that we haven't sold a listening room to Spotify for hundred million dollars. Yeah, yeah, it's not until the day comes. We might do it to SoundCloud for 200 mil. Ooh. Or maybe $50. SoundCloud doesn't have the money. $50. <laughs> yeah. $50. Yes. No, yeah. So, so yeah. someone actually asked, uh, I think it was an opposition MP or might be an MP. I'm not, I'm, I can't recall, but someone asked her. And she said that no foreign worker has asked me to apologize. For no what? one has asked for an apology. For the, this COVID For thing. the COVID thing. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Fucking <laughs> wait, where is she though? Where where is she staying? Like where is she living? What's her headspace in? I don't know. Yeah, I no. Know. Th- and then there's another party. Uh, okay, so there's Red Dot. Uh, yes. and then there's a uh, People's Voice. There's Reform Party. Reform Party, which is Kenneth J. Rathenham's party. But um, they previously in the 2015 um general elections they were contesting uh, way more constituencies constituencies yeah, yeah. than right now though. He's n- he's uh serving his stay at home notice now because he flew back from the UK. Ah. So he was not able to be present at the rally well, tapings. Could have, they could have just no, no. The rally tapings is uh, just do like a live stream. Live. No, live streamer. No, the rally tapings is at a studio. You have to go in and stand at the podiums and then you talk. Uh. Yeah. So he sent like a proxy. He sent another guy, and then there were only two people out of four or five. So it it looked pretty pathetic, la, and they yeah, were they were slaughtered on the that, comments. That, okay, there's the another one called People's Power Party. Do we know yeah. much about them? I don't know. The triple P-P-P. P-P-P. Right? PPP. No, yeah, P okay, Q. That, I think that that kind of brings it back that there are so many of them. And what 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 do they st- like? We don't know what they stand for, and there's so many of them. And why why do they want to go in? Are their solutions the best? We can't answer any of that because if there's so many solutions, then yours is guaranteed not. No, the but best. you you got to think about it like. You gotta put more factors into it, Sean. Like sometimes people want to join the more established um uh opposition parties, but mm. they get rejected. And then they have to create their own. Yeah, no, then they get fucking butt hurt. They're like, Oh fuck, I wanna serve mm. your I wanna serve the but country that, and that then the, yeah, you see that's um, I can that's my fun that's my, my issue with most of the opposition is like why are they even there? Like I know you're there to oppose the incumbent party, and we need that. We need a we need another voice. But w- some of you, you don't really need to exist. Y- and the and fucking now, and situation get, that and uh, the, the market it, no the market will eliminate them eventually, right? Yeah. yeah. And how, many, Pongo, how, how pa- many of them have been limited, eliminated? Uh? How many of them have like introduced like in last election and now f- gone? Dude, I think like people's voice mm. is quite. N- People's voice is quite new, right? What no, is it? Your, your iron, oh, ironing. Right. Oh, people's sounds voice. Like a people's that was voice. loud. Yeah. yeah. People's voice is P- people's voice is new. New. I I don't think they were PSP here in new. 2015. Lim Tian was with another party. He left the party and he started People's Voice recently. Right. Okay. Yeah. And then there's another one called Singapore Democratic Alliance. Yes, SDA. So Cham Si Tong was part of that. Ah. Oh. Yeah. So and so then he wanted to leave. He wanted to contest a GRC. In 2015, okay, right. so he was a uh, MP for Ch- uh, for Potobase under SDA Singapore Democratic Alliance, and he wanted to contest a GRC, but I think they did not have enough candidates mm. or suitable candidates that he would feel that with himself. Yeah, so he left uh, Potobase mm. and he made his wife 
uh, stand election mm. at Porto Pase against Sito. And they lost, right? And she lost. Yeah. But it was not a big margin. She did not lose like like, like terribly, right? Mm. And he stood at Bishan Topayo GRC and they lost narrowly. Mm, mm. Is Cham Si Stong still no, running? He retired, he right? No, no, he's he, not, he's not. he passed. No, he hasn't passed on. He, I, I think he's very, very old and yeah, he's not yeah. in the. Yeah, he was really real. in a wheelchair by uh, during the last elections. Yeah, it was, it was quite hard on him. Yeah. yeah. So I think Pasiris Pongo got it hard, man. They are fighting a three-way uh, dogfight mm. against uh, PAP, and PAP is Teo Chi Hin, hating it. Yeah, that yeah. is uh, going to be a tough one on them. Uh, so it's PAP, People's Voice, and Singapore no, Democratic I Alliance. I don't think it'll be part and SDA. Yeah. I don't think it'll yeah. be. I think for those ones with PAP is going to win with multiple oppositions, they don't have to worry. If there's yeah. multiple opposition parties there, it just takes the vote away from the main one. Yes. Okay. So what do we know about Red Dot United? Not much. Jesus Christ. Uh, it sounds the, like a football club. The, the only Dude, person who spoke during after the nomination was a was a Chinese lady with short hair. Ooh, how short though? Short hair turns Very me on. short. Short hair turns me on. Uh, shorter than your hair. Oh, yeah. No. Okay, uh, can we can I, can I pull up the manifesto? The manifesto of Red Dot United? Yes. Pull and let's in? see what they have. Uh okay. hopefully it's not mirrored, CNA. Let's mirrored go. from the club goals of uh, Manchester United la, because yeah. you know they're Scomo struggling. Goals. They're struggling. Put four in and it'll have the opposition score none. I think Jurong might be five, if I'm not wrong. Sorry? Oh, yeah, yeah, five. Okay. And they've got a brother and sister in, in, in the in the group for the GRC, right? Oh yeah, yeah. GRC. Hey, she's kinda cute though. No, not really actually. The uh, RDU gr- guarantee Red Dot United Jesus Christ Okay Push for policy changes Red In areas such United. as Job, housing, healthcare Arts and culture To improve the lives And happiness of Singaporeans And reduce the anxiety And stress Ever- So general Advocate for Singaporeans To have more options And flexibility Through access to Needed information On our governments uh, Governance And reserves management And in areas like The use of their Own CPF And education Champion policies that make Singaporeans ready for the future, focusing on wages, economy, total fertility rate, and climate change, and safeguard our constituency constituency by subjecting by subjecting constitutional changes to a much greater level of scrutiny and debate. It's very general, though. Jesus Christ! It's very general, and that's the only constituency that they are wait, so standing wait, at. So on. how the fuck are they going to change hold, hold, uh, challenge any, constitu- any uh, constitutional the- challenge? Has any of the opposition actually said for ministerial pay to be in review? Yes. Workers' party, right? PSP and Workers' party. Just the just the two of them, right? And SDP. And SDP, yeah. Yeah. So like that's not bad. That one, that one, I can get behind. Like your ministerial pay has to be reviewed, not just because of like corruption or that, but you see, Mister Corbyn one has left, retired. Okay, so and he's left with really nothing, not much to to no leave legacy behind. behind no uh. and. All this time he's been receiving that ministerial pay. So the only thing we have we can put on him is that he was never corrupt. That's all. Okay, so um under um the manifesto of uh, Red Dot United, yeah. Um under the introduction, the second point. Can we continue to remain a sampan, even a sampan 2.0? The PAP has said over and over and over again that Singapore is not ready for multi-party de- democracy. That only they have the A team to take Singapore forward, but let us not forget that a sampan even a Sampan 2.0 with the stadiums of hands can only take its passion- passengers that far. Interesting. Mm. Why a Sampan though? Uh, what simple small. analogy la, Dumbing what, it down la. No, what, Why not a small. aircraft small. No, aircraft carrier we're small. that can house like fucking B-20 bombers or some shit because their thing is with red like dot, nuclear weapons. Uh, red dot, if they use what? aircraft carrier then like red dot aircraft carrier Sam- don't make sense la. Sampan is like in the 1800s. Wait, but are they so saying we, are, we are, are in 2020. Are they saying that Singapore, uh, Singapore is like a Sampan or are they saying that PAP is claiming oh. that Singapore is like a Sampan? If it's the latter, then it's actually trying P- to pin PAP down. Actually, yeah, it yeah. feels like it feels like that. Yeah, yeah. If it's well, a former, then yeah. it's a different, uh, different thing. Then you calling us sampan? Yeah, like oh, now what? Yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so 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 they are claiming that PAP has caused Singapore to remain like a sampan, and they want to upgrade it to a sampan two point oh. 
No, it's sampan for the general public and it's fucking high end yacht for Ooh, why didn't, yeah, for, why didn't for they, them. Why for, didn't they yeah. say they want yeah. to increase the yacht because they don't dare. Mm. They don't really know no, how they uh, do it because no one can ever promise yachts for everyone, right? Sampan can one. No, actually, when you all brought that that doctor, uh, what's his name? Doctor Yong, Yong Ang, Doctor Ang, Doctor Ang, yeah. I do appreciate that. I do appreciate. I do appreciate the honesty he he came up with that thing. That like they just want to deny the the. The majority. I can get behind that. I can get behind why you want to do that. I can get behind the fact that you are together just to deny the fact that you don't want them to make policies on a whim. That that yeah. that's yeah. perfectly fine. And my whole argument with the fact that I don't want this many uh, opposition is that the thing is I understand people who can have different ideas and solutions to it, but the only thing that guarantees me that I want to vote you is uh, vote you in is that your idea is the better one. But and you will never know, and I can't see that. You will I, never know. I do know how the fact that there's so many others. No, but then you the would have to is, make I a decision. I don't right? know. You would have, you I don't would know have to make a I judgment. I don't know yours is the best. Yeah, but the fact there's so many others makes it worse for me because then I know that there are other options. Actually, there's so many others don't really matter because you they, only have two choices. They they do they do in the fact that I don't have two choices and they're the two absolute choices. There as multitude of choices so but I, technically I, I you only have know, two absolute I choices I won't know which one's the best you only have two choices it's either the PAP or the opposition in your constituency in my constituency in, in, yes. in the, in the and con- that's in the only vote that you can cast that because that's true uh, that's the only vote you can cast or, or, or an alternative party la. yeah it's PAP or the alternative yeah m- my view will, will never change that there's no need for that many uh. If there's one solid one, there there's no need for so many. But then the no and need for proven, so many, right? And, and it's the proven thing that when you have things like the red dot and the RV and opposition that don't really matter to me, that they don't really matter to me. Like if RV ran in Nisun, yeah. I'd count them out. I've never heard of them. I don't agree RV, with them. RV. Uh, 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 red dot United. No, then the other one. Reform People Party. Reform RP. Party. RP. RP. Reform or Party or People's Voice. Ah, PV. Sorry, PV. Yeah. yeah. PV, all these letters. People's Voice. Like no, but the reason why people have didn't hear about People's Voice, right, was because Lim Tian, right, he kept the candidates' identity, right, like almost like a fucking secret until the nomination day. Yeah. Why though? That's weird. He was like, I'm not going to give them any fucking chance to like research them uh, and uh, try to find like character w- assassinate, but like whatever fuck yeah. shit they're trying that to do. You're denying the people to know. <laughs> no, but now you know what you have. What the PAP? You see, they. This is very calculated, right? If you're going to say that now, we don't have enough time to find out about them. Whose fault is it? Mm. Is it my fault to call elections that soon? To to. Submit the writ no, I mean, to I, to I, I, uh, I don't dissolve parliament and then to call elections within two weeks. I, I don't. I don't mean about PAP. Mm. I mean about people. Like we don't know about them. Yeah, as but well. you know that's how you play the system, right? You, or that's how you you canvass for votes. You got to either the, the, convince the people that, by uh, I, by showing like, okay, this is what we're gonna do. This mm. is our manifesto. This is what we're gonna do. And if I'm not wrong, they just released their manifesto last night. <laughs> Okay. Ooh, people's voice people's voice yeah right. even like, wrong. like the whole thing I, I understand where all this is coming with like like uh, people want to be anti uh, anti PAP or anti incumbency or the anti stuff but I mean is it right do you want to ca- do you want to canvas for vote or do you want to be completely upfront with the people you but is it wrong it is what do you mean is it wrong you, you ask the question is it right but uh, is it wrong to do? But you're just to asking do something me the like same that? question again. It's like, yeah. no, the, no. The, the, there, more important, no. the more important one is that is it right? When you're asking, is it wrong? No, because it's it's neither y- right or wrong. You're just coming. I, it is no, You're just coming from a point where you want to prove that one down. But it's like the more important, the more important one I will put is is it right? Not is it wrong? Okay. No, it's it's because. You uh, may deem it right, uh, or you may deem is, it wrong. The thing Someone is, else you might deem it right or wrong. You know, you you have to be the one that is the for speaking for the right. If you, if you're 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 just doing on a strategic position where you don't want it to to shame your your uh con- your your nominees, you have to you have to put up a nominees that are not able to be shamed that have nothing dark to hide. 
that you have to put up the best one that you have. No, but it why, might not be about anything be to so hide. S- why would you be so scared that they can pull up dirt when that's not? No, no, I said it, but that's but not I what he like, said. Uh, that's he, not what Lim Tian said. might not be the one, but yeah, yeah, we're just inferring. We're just yeah, inferring that, that shouldn't be your goal. You should, your, if that's your strategy, you're telling us that you just didn't want them to pull up dirt. No, I'm saying it. I'm saying cool. It. I'm, yeah. I'm cool. I'm with not that. saying okay. that. I'm cool with that. So let's let's okay. So let's look at acknowledge that that is a flawed point that. You're holding it no, back. My, that my point. That's my point. Yeah, yeah. So I, I just put it out there. Yeah, but no, it, okay, so let's look point. at uh, people's party, uh, people's voice uh, manifesto. Mm. So according to uh, China, China News Asia, mm. what you need to know about the party is founded by Lim Tian, who was a former SG of the National Solidarity uh, uh, NSP. Yeah. Wow, he was SG, dude. So he left and then founded uh, People's Party, uh, People's Voice in 2018. Uh, the main tagline is "Make Singapore Our Home Again." Sounds a lot like make America great again. Yes. Well, yeah. So it's a uh, proposal. Have you seen the Trump new logo? No. The Who Trump's, gives a shit? The Trump's uh, logo. His proposals looks, include looks returning like the uh, CPF monies to Singaporeans when they turn fifty-five and slashing the pay of ministers. Wow, Jesus Christ! The party has also spoken out about institutioning affordable healthcare, mm-hmm. scraping the impending GST hike, and having a minimum wage. Wow, sounds very, very controversial. Though. No, WP has, uh, Jameis said the same thing about the minimum wage. Quite a number of uh, opposition scrapping parties. Scrapping GST? Uh, scrapping GST is quite harsh, but... Uh, That's insane though. Few, uh, quite a number. Have all, almost all the parties have been saying yeah. that we are not going to... The GST thing it cannot climb up beyond 7 and all this kind of shit. They want to increase to 11 or something, right? 10. 10. 10%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um... Yeah, so then they they have a whole list of the different people, uh, the different party members who are contesting in different uh, areas of Singapore. Yeah, you can look it up on. Uh, I think it's Jalan Besar and somewhere else, right? It's Jalan Besar and Pasir Ris Punggol, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, yeah. Their their candidates seem pretty legit though. So we have Mr. Michael Fang Amin, forty three, runs a biology center. Then we have uh, Mr. Noor Aslan, forty nine, global hal- halal co- consultant. Okay. Uh, There's good money in that. And then we have a blogger, Mr. Jire Lim K. Chow. 61 in the blogger, wow. Woo. Quite late to the game, though. And then we have uh, Mr. Siva Kum Aran, 57 Run Institution Center. So I think they have a mixture of, like, uh, you know, um, people who work in the professional sector. I think there's only also. one constituency there. There's another one where they've got, a, like, a doctor, and Lim Tian is running. Jalan Basa, Lim Tian is running. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right. That I think that's the one that they're gonna concentrate on la, to 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 really it's win and one. get uh get votes. Yeah. Yeah. We, which other weird fuckers are are, are running, uh? Besides besides Red Dot United, besides uh Singapore People's Party oh, SPP. There's one there's one oh, uh, Steve, uh, Steve Chia, the there's one in former independent MP. one. Who the fuck is that? There's one independent? Uh, the N C N C M P oh, is it? Those are weird fuckers. Former former N C M P yeah. Wait, <laughs> Singapore what? Singapore? People's Party S P P. That was funny. Singapore? Steve, Steve Chia. Chia. Steve Chia is running. He got uh, ousted because he had an affair with a town council staff. <laughs> <laughs> yes. The, the other MP, the other guy who had uh, an affair, Yeah. he was left. Was he just he resigned and he never came back. Wasn't he a PAP? No, PAP who? had one, right? Like, if I'm, yeah, a PAP, Michael Palmer. He was a speaker of parliament and he resigned. He left. He left his law firm as well and started his own one. And he has not returned to politics because he knew that there was the fucking it's not really nail hard, in the it's coffin. It's very hard for, for people to trust. Like, uh, you can't even stay true to your wife. Exactly, yeah. But uh, this guy has got balls. Right. He's running in another party. Okay, so SPP breakdown. Singapore uh, People's Party Manifesto breakdown yeah. number one. Empower Singapore's youth. Reduce the voting age from 21 to 28. Um, allow... Ah, no, wait. Yeah. Reduce? That's not reduce. reduce. The that voting age from 21 to... 21 to 18, sorry. Huh? That's it. That, that's it. You said reduce, you said reduce and said 28. And oh, said 28. shit. So yeah. I was like, that's not... Uh, that's, that's after like... That ain't a reduction. That's an increase. That's after three pints of uh, beer. Yeah. So reduce from 21 to 28 the voting age of Singaporeans. So you said it again. Yeah. You said 20 21 <laughs> to 28 again. Okay, reduce the voting age from 21 to 18 All right. of Singaporeans. Yeah. That's there not empowering youth. Uh, allow the use of parents' CPF monies for education. Increase youth okay, engagement yeah. in policy making. Yeah, fuck that. I do, doesn't know what that means. Lower the cost of living. So no further increase of GST. Increase cash supplement under silver support How? scheme. 
That's funny. Um, like those how? who qualify for free travel, those who qualify for the silver transport scheme should have free travel on public transport. Introduce minimum wage. Yeah. What 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 WP is saying as well. Uh, Jesus Christ. I think two other parties. Combat the climate emergency. Uh, investment from carbon initiative operation resources, mandatory environment environmental impact. Yeah, quite vague shit, dude. Uh, yeah. Number four, strengthen retirement ed- uh, through CPF. So ensure retirement adequacy. Oh, wait, all this have to be vague, right? They don't actually have to explain how, no, they, but where how they plan to Are you it, reading right? this straight from your manifesto? Or? Uh, it's a breakdown. Ah, okay. It's a breakdown. So allow... Under CPF, like you, allow partial withdrawals on compassionate grounds. Mm, okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. So, but, uh, actually, I'm not too sure about that, but are there bigger... like? More uh, defined breakdowns. Like yes, if you, go you, to you would websites. have to go and find their ah. own the, yeah, the full yeah. manifesto. So WP will have so like this is on Chinese Asia, right? This uh, is Vulcan Post. Okay, okay so if, like okay. WP yeah. will have like your website is like how they plan to. Uh, yeah, you know, they will they, have like a seven page so manifesto. Have, like ten yeah. or like we want to reduce the GST. And this is how and we do it. Do, yeah, yeah, this is how we do that's, it. Yeah. That's, that's that's good. That like you, you, I mean, I wouldn't know. Like you, you say all these things. Okay, sounds very nice. So under number eight, affordable housing, extending the lease buyback scheme after a period of five years, all HDB owners should be given the opportunity to sell. Their lease back to HDB at a price that's near the val- uh, market value. Mm. Isn't that what we are able to do now? No. We really? can't sell it back to HDB. You have to sell it to another person. Or resale, right? Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. We sell it to another human being. Yeah, I, w- I was uh, listening to a debate like earlier in this afternoon mm. um, where I think it was on the online citizen, right? So on their YouTube page, they had the live stream where they were talking to two guys who were discussing all the different aspects of HDB. Mm. And one guy br- brought up a very important point, right? If HDB was meant to be housing for uh, affordable housing for the people, for the general public, yeah, right? Pricing f- new, brand new flats mm. for brand new buyers, so mm. first time buyers, BTO la. like a BTO yeah. or a DBSS or whatever it is for a first time buyer, mm. right? Assuming that any of us gonna get married, we want to buy a house for the first time. But I'm going to pay the same price as someone else who has already owned like multiple houses. Private houses though, not HDB. No, whatever. Private housing, or HDB. Second-time buyers nope. have to or second-time buyer. Second-time I'm going to pay the same amount. They should it not does uh, not in- incentivize me to buy a HDB. No, but if you have private uh, uh, property, you can't buy BTO flats. Okay, doesn't matter. Okay, no, 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 doesn't matter. So you can sell already, the house. Right? You're already out. You're already out. If you have a private home, uh-huh. you should not even you, be considering you, you can't even HDB. Consi- you can't consider. I'm uh, saying that you have a private home, then you sell the private yeah. home. So with that money, now you downgrade. Or you, you oh, just feel that you want to okay, buy okay. HDB. You still okay, have to buy a resale. You can't you buy still, BTO. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct. Right? Yep. But you will pay the open market value. Mm. Me as a first time buyer, I still have to pay the open, open market, market value. value. Yeah. Oh, so that's so even the B- yeah. yeah, yeah, got it. If got I it. don't want to buy BTO, I want to buy resale. But I'm a first time buyer. Mm. There's no incentive for me to buy HDB anymore. Yeah, because I'm still paying the. I'm same. still going to pay an exorbitant amount so they, yeah. for a that house that was meant to be. In that sense, for if you can afford it, they want you to housing. go. They want you. To, if you're a first time buyer, they they don't want you initially to go for HDB. If you can afford it, they rather you go private lah. No, no, no. What I'm saying is that the whole idea that it's meant to be affordable housing for people who can't afford to buy houses is out. Is out. No, it's I mean, against their you, you like look fucking. look at the prices now. Yeah, yes. it's mad. Why would I want to buy a four room flat for four hundred plus thousand, five hundred yeah. thousand? That's pretty crazy, yeah. right? When but the whole intention was to buy, but you was don't to make have affordable a choice, houses. Right? Now yeah. you don't really no, have a choice. No, that's the problem. They, they, they do. Yeah. They are charging you for the land. Ah. They are including the land price into your flat. Mm. Yeah. So one of them was saying that it should not be the case because the government owns the land. So it's state land which has been leased out to HTB. Right? And then HTB constructs the building. You're going to pay land price and construction price. Okay, so be- we need to clarify HTB is a private entity, right? Mm, now now no. now it's somewhat yeah. It's not government owned, right? Uh, what? It un- it's uh. But when you started out. But yeah, when it started, it started, it started out, out, it was Ministry government, of national government, government owned. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I think we brought this up last week. Like the whole whole thing of government. I mean, that's one thing. I don't know whether they don't want to bring it up or they've elected not to. But I think that's the gray area. The same yeah, thing with SMRT and the then area. the trains yes, and LTA and, and SMRT. Yeah. That's yeah. the one thing I think we brought up last week. Is like uh. 
we want the we want the transport uh, transportation system to grow mm. but the government's way of dealing with it is to privatize it so they can make a profit from it and then grow from incentive yeah instead of you know government run transportation system mm. where it's non not say non profitable but the profits just go into running it and i think how they get over this gray area is by making a stat board yes right that's how they that's but how stat board is still under government partly so, so, private so, as well no so no. No? Statboard is under the government. So the one okay. thing is right. We we see all this like the fact that they they privatize most things and they they they've like made they push the responsibility off to to marketing area on on the value of like maybe free not say free market but more of the it's private. Because you have this very you know, weird thing where you have the like illusion of free market. But the thing is, the opposition hasn't really raised any issues to that. So I don't say not never raised lah. I don't really know, but yeah. One interesting to me is that I've never seen an opposition come out and say like we'll make it government run again, because they admit that it's a. It's, but that it's, that it's can't a working, be. It's a that working, can't be an honest it's pledge, not, though. It's not. You know why? Because it's, because it okay. works. Okay. One thing I've noticed this time around, right, mm-hmm. is that Workers Party, like Pritam Singh, he has made it so clear that there's no way that they're going to out the PAP government. Mm-hmm. He has made it. Crystal clear that the PAP government is still going to form the majority. The majority. Yeah, government. because of the, I right? mean, the the yeah. thing is that they've set themselves up that they've made policies where very hardly people can question. HDB is very hard. They can't overrule a HDB. They can't take away uh, housing, uh, public housing. Yeah, but no one is for taking away the housing. I though. mean, no one. Yeah, that's the thing. You can't. It's a. It's such a good policy that it's you know they put it in because such small no, country. Every it, every government right has will have a housing policy like yeah, a state but, housing but policy again, right like when you raise it up like now it's not no longer that affordable yes so it's not about taking the policy away it's, it's yeah. about making it better mm. amending it have amending you it, heard, it. have, have yeah. you heard one good one for amending it yes what what is it because i haven't heard, i'm asking not for it's, it. it's where the government now has to subsidize brand new buyers mm. And not let them pay the same amount as a as a person who and has who, bought who multiple houses before. No, but they have loans for uh, newly married couples that you can take from like. Uh, yeah, but that okay, but the loan just makes you just puts you into debt. That that who 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 who's, who's wait wait. But government subsidizing BTO flats though for for ma- newly married couples. How much? Forty uh, plus twenty thousand, thirty thousand. Thirty thousand. Yeah, when the house is five hundred thousand. No, who's who's opting for who who's whose plan is to PSP. PSP WP? and WP. Only yeah. these two. Uh. Yeah? SDP? Mm. No, three. Three of them. And their solution is to? Their solution is to make sure that the houses being built will be cheaper for brand new buyers. How? Mm. No, by, by having subsidies. La, by having subsidies. No, heavy how, subsidies. How do they ensure that it's cheaper? What, 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 what guarantee is like the, the, the contractor they get is like the cheaper ones? Or... No, instead of or are they subsidizing it using government funds. Of course, government funds. And la. then government funds is funded by what? Taxpayers' money, la. And in order to ensure that taxpayers' money. That is, is why almost every party wants to know what is in our reserves, but no one knows, right? But no one knows. Yeah. Except for the PAP. Yeah. But why do they know what they want to use the reserves? To, of course. To to fund for it. And, uh, and you're like okay to have an economic plan you need to know how many yeah, yeah, how you much need you need to know how much you're okay with so using the res- why not? reserves to, to, to pay for this why thing, not so, I mean, no we have really digged into our reserves for the COVID thing like. yeah, yeah. yeah no, but you're yeah. okay with it we'll like. the, the repercussion of that is that to replenish it is using no because we have a big problem now because uh, Singapore how, how did, not, our, how did the money go in there first I'm not asking this to antagonize you I'm asking for no but the important question is how did the money get there first no because I think where, where did the it's where from us it's from CPF yeah. the HDB is funded by CPF they take they borrow money from us to fund government no but where does the CPF money go that's the first thing no, okay the thing is uh, but, but where, where does GIC get this money ag- it's an agreement right the CPF is a uh, uh, initiative by the government to borrow from its citizens yeah the yeah, CPF okay. but is then a, borrow then where does it go no no they're borrowing from the citizens to fund government initiatives like no, no like, that's like, a question that's the thing that has to be answered mm-hmm. it gets borrowed where does the money go to after that investments and all that, yeah. yes so yeah. GIC foreign investments GIC and Tamasic Holding right so GIC makes so investment uh, decisions right and then from there 
it gets splintered into okay, all wait, the different. Be, 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 before we jump to that, so what what is the layout like? So Tamasic Holding, GIC under or GIC above Tamasic Holding? GIC okay, funds Tamasic. Hold on, before this becomes any more boring with all this. this no, no, it's not boring. Okay. No, the thing is that the question here is that. Are you your question on the reserve is whether we have any money inside less than no 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 less how much less yeah. than less than what they they've touted because I think they've said that we've got like trillions or yeah okay I don't doubt so that so Singapore si- Singapore taxpayers Singapore mm. CPF goes into GIC which is a sovereign government sovereign fund mm. right that's owned by Singaporeans technically and then they invest into Tamasic Holding which is a private company yeah yeah who invests our who's run by who's yeah. run by yeah. And their self-declared assets stands at three hundred and thirteen billion. Right, right. Yeah, I think According I think to the last yeah. annual report la. But yeah. the, 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 it's not a full annual report. It's only the information that they have put out on their website. Three one three billion. Mm. Revenue. No, 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 no. Assets. Oh, assets. Okay. And yeah. the main yeah. reason why they haven't released the information about reserves to it's the a private company. Position. It's a private company. They don't have no, the reserve. No, no, I'm talking about the Singapore reserves. Yeah. Uh, they haven't released that information to anyone is because I don't know why country secret how how can it be secret has has uh, any if it's other, meant if it's your country wait, needs to has operate any other country re- revealed yeah, their yeah the results? Norwegian sovereign fund they have a full report right, for it uh, even the US as well the the, the debt uh, calculator is, is known like every yeah, you can just check it online China, to see how much like US debt Australia and all China don't uh, okay, China, China can't compare okay, no no nah, China is different and the rest also China and North Korea is a different story democratic yeah. countries they usually reveal their yeah, reserves that's, their debt or, it's, it's or open, reserve yeah. it's open yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. that's why, that's Wait, why we have right no we don't have our, we, n- we never we there's speculation but no confirmation on what the don't have don't have we don't have any information of our debt are you kidding me by right we are not in debt we are not we are not in debt yeah by right yeah. By right. No, you said by right, but like you said, we don't have any. As, as far as we know, no we're not in debt. debt. And it doesn't seem like we're in debt as well. Uh. Yeah. No, but we have no information out there. Like We only have like GDP and no. Yeah. No, yeah. No, so, okay. Yes. So our reserves are secret. Uh. Yes. In the billions of dollars. And, so and, Halima Yaakob and could be. Own, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, Technically, in, Halima Yaakob is the only person. That she, or the she president could, who knows the. She could be opening the yeah. vault and. Who holds the key in. to the treasury there's or something, no right? Vault, and, and, there's and, no vault. There's no vault. And back swimming. And, oh, no. Why do make it so much fun? Like, Istana, and then right below it is like. Because the, there were, there, when there was. No, a there's a vault in the MSA. Yeah, but. No, no. MSA different. I'm talking about the, you know, Duckwing Duck kind of vault. Like just jump, jump in and swim yeah. in the yeah. gold the like Istana, points. You know, like go inside. You want to see our reserves? You dive into the bags. Then you oh, open cash, yeah. Then you open up. No, I cannot. You, they've already proved like you jump into bags. I will also hurt yourself. This is like no, but I'm pretty sure they they are stuff. they will be hoarding gold, right. silver. Do you think they'll be hoarding like r- Reming P? No, I'm actually hoping they're hoarding. Like my my only intention. Was you see mouse face on the. Hey, what the fuck is this? Why is so many like paper currency with mouse face? Yeah, no. On my, my only hope is that they are actually hoarding like. <laughs> You really go on the like, Istana and then you I'm, I'm pretty sure most of, of it is digital assets la. like everything is you know you own property you own stocks equity yeah so we don't know what we have in reserves so the only thing we know is that the government was so um, prepared to spend close to 100 billion so in exact what 92, 93 billion mm. and they have repeated that fucking amount don't know how, how many times already yeah, so right. so my, you can assume that the reserves will if, be if more than that. If I would assume that yeah, hundred billion was spent like that, yeah. oh, we really need to. I, I would hope that reserves like, maybe ten times. Uh, I hope so. Yeah. I hope so. You yeah. wouldn't want to know that they spent like a ten percent or fifty yeah. percent of the thing just to. But it's like yeah, that's fuck. Like Halima will be jumping into a a vat of like uh, no concrete. I, I have my doubts whether it's actually her decision to do anything or not. But <laughs> yeah, that, that's that, a different. That is why Tanching Bok. Dr. Tan was actually talking about it. He said that, you know, that's why I wanted to run for president. Uh, that's why I ran, control. but I did not win. Yeah. But that was one of the purposes of me running for president. Was he fight? He was fighting with Tony Tan, right? Yeah. Tony Tan, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was yeah. actually quite disappointing for me because... Yeah, kind of you, you told this a couple of episodes ago that you voted for him. Kind of voted yeah. for him. Yeah. I mean, y- y- no one has to question the power that Hanima Yaakob has la, when she no. is not even voted I by the actually, people. Yeah. I actually and when she's her, making Milo. I yeah. actually question her and question Tony Tan. The, the two of them are just too... F- I mean, too fishy. La. 
<laughs> which party were they from? Yeah. yeah you know, then you have to... Slightly too fishy. Like, yeah. I don't know, but I guess nobody wants to bring up... Oh, but then again, the president like, of Singapore doesn't have any... Doesn't hold any real power they, or real office. The yeah. power over it's it's just about the reserves. It's over yeah. the reserves. They're, they're the ones and national security though. Just run they, can, they can call in the army or something, right? Uh, no, call in no, the no, army no. Do I, think you've, I think you've mistaken this for the US. Yeah. Like the US is oh, I can't call it National Guard. What? The, the, no, uh, the, the US. Army, uh, army is governmental thing. It's like if there's a war. Fuck, the Trump comes. wanted the National Guard to enter don't know how many states, but cannot. The governor had the, had the power. Ah, that's true. Yeah, that's a different story. La. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I think for now, we, we're going to stop using uh, America as a, as, a, as a benchmark to anything. Land of the free. Land of the fuck. The like it's aw- awful it's free. awful everything about them is wrong like almost wrong yeah they, yeah. they, they, they claim to be uh, what I mean I don't think they claim to be like, but uh, no the corruption is like obviously it's corruption sick. everywhere though they claim to be the land of the free home of the brave and 4th of July yeah. oh Nobody yeah 4th of July was oh very fucking very Twitter good. everywhere oh, yeah was. every fucking should we fire like fireworks in my bedroom on the 9th of August no. Uh, no, and we like, you know, Look, record it I'm on our podcast. If and WP and wins here, then we can. And that, <laughs> that that person hasn't even taken down his flag from last year. No like election la, That's why election coming. That's why. Singapore. That's a patriot. That's a patriot. Singapore. Vote wisely. Vote. Uh, the, this week we anything, uh, do we have any jokes this week? Uh, no. Yes, I have one though. Oh uh, yes. Um. What did the devil say to the priest? Come suck my cock. No, he kids. said to the priest, could you please exit the child? Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. And, right. I, and in this situation, I don't think Josie was referring to a Hindu priest. No. I think it was referring to a Catholic. A Catholic priest. Yeah, specifically well, uh, Catholics. Hindus don't believe in the devil. And, you know, like the yeah, devil, yeah, devil. Technically, yeah. No, Technically, right. we don't believe in the devil. Yeah. Like it's yeah. only it's only the Catholics that believe in that, and yet no, the Christians. All that believe the one that speaks yeah. for that belief is still touching and the kids. And Muslims as well. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's an obsession with purity, I guess. All right, should we should we end this? Yeah. Um. Yeah, I think we can tease the audience just before we end. Um, that we might be showing, showing them some nip. No. <laughs> <laughs> that we might. No, oh, don't don't do it. Uh, that's R twenty one. Uh, we might be doing a podcast with uh, John on the Finders ep- uh, Part 2 oh. which is oh. focusing on uh, Jeffrey Epstein and but that's Galeen. not the Finders though yeah yeah I mean yeah Galen Maxwell la. yeah Galen and Maxwell and uh, Jeffrey Epstein and Jeffrey the whole Epstein. shit and the whole Netflix documentary so I, uh, we have not scheduled with John at any time soon but might be coming you the next few weeks you might be seeing Sober Sean so yeah. yeah we'll just tease the audience for a bit Long Kang Long yeah. Kang the Long Kang kitties the Long Kang and Lobang the Long Kang Kitties and Lobang Boys. Lobang Boys, yes. Playing with our assholes. Uh, should we end this? Getting cats to lick our assholes. Oh, oh that, that's bestiality. On those notes.